Rita, we've seen in London uh, demonstrations against the lockdown. So, I mean, the, the, the fight back has begun against lockdown lunacy. Have a look. Here are some shots from uh, London, Rita. Amazing shots. Yes, massive crowds, uh, peaceful, which is lovely to see. And they are wanting their freedoms reinstated. They want to be able to uh, see their family, hold funerals where, where numbers aren't limited and people aren't socially distanced and, and, and get businesses back operating at full capacity, particularly given how well they've gone with their vaccine rollout. Uh, so the, the, the masses were out today and there is a, a fight back because there you've had... Boris Johnson's government and Labor very much pro-lockdown. You've had the media be pro-lockdown. And so there's a lot of people who feel like they've been voiceless throughout this pandemic and, and their point of view, including medical experts who've come out and said, what we're doing is actually not uh, based on the evidence and it has all sorts of unintentional consequences that are negative, particularly when you look at the rates of cancer, heart disease, serious illnesses not being diagnosed early because people aren't going and getting their, getting them checked out. Um, yeah, oh, it's, it's they, absolutely. They, they feel like they've been voiceless, yeah. Well, they're not voiceless, as we know. Lawrence Fox, who set up his Reclaim Party, he'll be looking at those demonstrations, Rita and James, and going, wow, I'm on to something here. Because as Rita says, both Labor and, and the Conservatives there, well, Boris Johnson is a joke, he's not a Conservative. Um, but uh, we will be speaking to Lawrence Fox on the show next week because now Nigel Farage, has come out and has backed Lauren Fox, uh, Lawrence Fox for that mayoral position.